Hello everyone, Lodi, Zopardas music, yeah? Hi, hi, hi. Anyways, Zopardas chicken karhai tonight, yeah? Easy peasy, simple, there is no dramas with this stuff, yeah? Only few ingredients, yeah? No massive masalas or none of that. Um, hi, the total of us got here. Anyways, okay, right. I'm back at work. Thank God. Another shukar um, from uh, Wednesday. Well, on three days a week to start off with, but you know, better than nothing. And the Aju Zapartas Krai. What do we need for the Krai? They go, what do you mean? Tinka Siga. Not a much other bad, it was a thin car. Right. Um, we obviously have the chicken which I have washed. Eh? Make sure you wash all that, and obviously, chopped tomatoes. There's four chopped tomatoes and about three chopped green chilies. Um, teaspoon of salt. I don't put any more salt in my food. Uh, teaspoon white pepper. But same, a little bit more of the black pepper. No, actually, nearly a tablespoon of black pepper. Red chili powder. And this is the garlic ginger. Kutia chutia. Fresh, yeah. Beat up in I got frozen ones as well, but it's best to use fresh ones, yeah. It takes hardly any time. And tastes much, much better. Right. Coriander to Sutto, sutto fire on the top, meaning you know, garnish with, and that's it. So, brown the chicken in a little bit of oil. Once that's browned, you are use these, these um, distracting. Right, okay. Um, where was I? Brown the chicken. Once the chicken is brown, you add garlic ginger paste in it, mix it all nicely. Yeah. Um, or you could brown the garlic ginger paste first. It's, it's totally up to you, but this is the way I do it, yeah? Garlic ginger paste, red chili powder, uh, teaspoon of salt, mix it nice and well, add the um, tomatoes and the green chilies, right? Once that's all nicely mixed up, lower the heat, put the white pepper and the black pepper on top, and cover, let it cook for about 30 minutes. Job done. How simple is that? Even you guys can do it. Oh, who? Angie. Right, and uh, yeah, and then when it's ready, you just put some coriander on top. Job done. And if you want to be, do a little bit more fancy schmancy, you take another bit of ginger and you julienne the ginger. For you people who do not understand, julienne means make it little matchsticks, right? And you sprinkle that on top as well when you add the the coriander. Pick this to follow. Zapparaka. Right. 